How y'all doing? Sean, back for another video. And guys, this is exciting. This is good news for crypto. And everybody's been saying, hey, crypto is going to keep growing. It's going to be massively adopted. And regulation is coming, which is not a bad thing. And again, this ain't financial advice. No endorsements, nothing like that with anything. But guys, the SEC chair the other day, and there's a bill, and Congress had some meetings and things. And I'm not going to go into all that complicated jazz. But anyways, this is an amazing thing. So the SEC chair agreed that you know, Bitcoin and Ethereum are commodities. And he said he wouldn't mind seeing the CFTC oversight the regulation on Bitcoin and Ethereum. Now, all the other projects out there, not sure what's going to happen with that. But this is, in my opinion, bullish news for crypto. And having something considered a commodity versus a security versus something else, a property, what have you, it, it's an advantage, right? There's advantages and disadvantages to everything. And there's good things about, you know, security regulation that's not in commodity regulation. There's a good thing in commodity re regulation that's not in property regulation. But overall, I really love this statement and I love that we are furthering towards regulation in a good way. And I know a lot of people are scared of regulation, but guys, regulation in part is a good thing because there's a lot of people sitting on the sidelines of crypto, especially institutions, big businesses, huge investors that are just waiting for a little bit of a safety net in regulation for them to heavily purchase and invest in crypto. And this is an amazing thing. And there are advantages to commodities over securities. Again, there's advantages over securities over commodities. I'm going to do a separate video on the differences in securities, commodities, properties, and some disadvantages and advantages that you have in each one. But overall, guys, this is exciting news, and it's even more exciting that people are going more towards crypto every single day, and specifically governmental-wise, there's more and more talk and more and more discussion on furthering what regulation is going to look like. And I really love this. I really love that this was openly you know, discussed, that, hey, these could be commodities, and you know, the SEC, SEC chair <laughs> said he wouldn't mind seeing the CFTC oversight. Now... For crypto as a whole, one of these agencies or maybe all these agencies are going to have to exponentially expand to be able to cover everything in crypto. And even with just Bitcoin and Ethereum, the CFTC might have to expand and further their, their uh, establishment to be able to regulate and cover Bitcoin and Ethereum as a whole and do it in a very good fashion. Now, not sure exactly what's going to happen. And y'all know me, been in government work and done things and things do move slow sometimes. But this is great news. When there's good conversations like this and they're actually in meetings and actually official you know, meetings that are happening, this is a great thing. And this is how good movement gets started. It starts with the conversations. It starts with the meetings. And kind of having where the oversight's going to be is a great move because then everybody can kind of get ready for what's going to come and they can get ready for what they might expect. So overall, this is great bullish news. And again, next video, I'm going to cover what the difference is in the SEC and, you know, securities covering crypto and what's the difference in commodities and the CFTC covering crypto. But overall, guys, this is great. And the big picture of this is mass adoption is coming and more adoption is coming. And everybody who's in crypto right now or been in crypto for a while the more people that get in the crypto, the more agencies, the more institutions, the more companies, the better because that's more growth for the whole market of cryptocurrency, which is an amazing thing. But anyways, guys, I hope you all have a wonderful one. Be blessed. Do the best you can every day. And remember, share some positivity.